the fight. And Eddie. Edwards jumps into the backside. Brusco will kick him in the face. And Edwards still alive until Kirk takes him out. It's a battle in the mid lane. Don't make Makara shows him the shot to the face. Raw matches are interesting. I find Brawl PH low score gameplay boring. I, I agree, Kai. I think. Here, all right. Let me just talk about the brawl meta thing because I've seen a lot of clips clip around, uh, and and they've said like they've they've clipped only the the part where I said one to three game one to three. Oh, let's talk about this. Let's talk about this. Hey, to all the clippers out there, I saw the clips. A lot of the clips saying or just clipping the part where I said game one to three for the grand finals of MPL Indo was all right. We're fucked. But they didn't clip the part where I said game four to seven. It was already good. And by the time we got here, six, seven, it was already really good. They they didn't they didn't they didn't put that in. Alright? But yeah, no. The brawl meta thing, guys, in Indo, it's MLB. It's like Indo style MLBB. It's different to it's different to PH. When we're talking about pure MLBB, yes, we can say PH looks better, looks like the better macro, you know, everything, they're better macro. But remember. Yeah, yeah, not you, not you, Zikil, not you, not you, not not all the Clippers, some Clippers, some Clippers. PH is discipline, right? When it comes to the discipline game, textbook game, everything there, PH is number one. But remember, MSC, SRG won. SRG versus AP Bren, right? This matchup, AP Bren were 100% the better team fundamentally. They are 100% the better team with macro. They're 100% the better team who had better discipline. But who won? The team who was willing to take a risk as well. Take many risks, right? So that's what I see from the Indo teams that are going to represent, well, actually mainly TLID. I think for RQ, they're more like a PH team. RQ is very PH, the way they play right now. TLID, I was saying back in the regular season that they look like a PH team, the way that they just adapt. But now I think they, they've kind of like made their own style of MLBB. That's why I have really high hopes for TLID. RQ, I have high hopes for them to make it really far in M6, but winning M6, I'm not sure. That'll have to come down to, to him. Yeah, exactly. See, see, look at Vren, Coach Vren. Coach Vren said it too. That's why I said Brawl gameplay is the best. No playstyle can counter it. Because when you're playing all discipline and textbook, this kind of gameplay where you're just attacking and fighting is good. It's actually really good. And here, let's just draw a comparison. FNOP. The way that FNOP play, they are not a PH, like a full PH style kind of play style. Aurora are PH style. Like this is pure discipline, Aurora. FNOP, they are willing to take risks. They are more brawly than Aurora. They are the most brawly in uh, Filipino team. They're the most brawly Filipino team and they are number one. So you can't say... Pure discipline will work. Pure discipline will win. And you and the brawl meta is not a negative thing to say. I also said Indo is brawl. But this is good. This is... Well, actually, it can be good. It can be bad. It just depends on how they play M6 later. How they improve. No way Mirko said that FNOP is a brawl team. Bro, they're more brawly than, than Aurora. Replay the stream and listen to what I said. I didn't say they're a brawl team. I said they're more brawly. They're a brawly PH team. They're not a normal, discipline, pure textbook PH team. They're the most brawly PH team. Because they actually, you know, rely on their mechanics as well.